There is a changing of the guard at the West Virginia State Capitol. The Senate has a new majority leader who has a reputation for wanting to work across the aisle. So what issues might benefit? 13 News Chief Political Reporter Mark Curtis has more from the Capitol. When Senate President Mitch Carmichael gavels the legislature into session this year, he will have a new majority leader and Republican Senator Tom Takubo, a Kanawha County lung doctor. Takubo was just re-elected to a second term in the Senate. Both he and his Democratic counterpart are promising to be more cooperative on certain issues. I know for a fact that the people I serve with have hearts the size of elephants. I mean, they want West Virginia to win. It doesn't matter what initials at the, at the back of their, their name. When the Democrats were in control, I mean, we, we worked with the Republicans really well. I mean, it was always a place where we were moderate and, and balanced and worked well with them. I think the last couple of years, that's not really been the case as much. And maybe they can. In separate interviews, each man brought up his top priority, free community and technical college tuition in West Virginia. The House did not pass it. So it's my hope that we can do that to help try to build up our workforce. You know, we've got to try to continue to improve education to help our workforce. And those are the, the biggest things I think we have. I know the college technical community bill to get people uh, trades jobs, get them trained, RNs were in desperate need for nurses, uh, get, get people that maybe couldn't afford to get those educations in the past. Uh. As a physician, Senator Takubo may be called on for his expertise on health issues such as medical marijuana in the state's opioid crisis. With new leadership comes new calls for bipartisanship and cooperation. We'll see if that happens when the legislature convenes here on January 9th. Outside the state capitol in Charleston, Mark Curtis, 13 News, working for you.